Well then boys and girls, for ages, I don't know if I mentioned it the other day, but I've um, I've had weather stations of all manner and shape, uh, Nitatmo one, um, a fine offset, just cheap ones. And I've always wanted um, a Davis one, but they're expensive anyway. I've, I've gone for the Vantage View here. I've always wanted a Davis one. They're bloody expensive, but this is the cheaper one. <laughs> and it's just come today, so I thought I'd unbox it with you. Well, there it is. I've been dead good as well. I've just come back from shopping. My neighbours popped it round because I, I were out when it came. I've had my me, um, me dinner and not even opened it yet. I've been <laughs> dying to, but I thought, no, get me snap out way first. Right, might be a bit rubbish, this, boys and girls. <clears throat> Light's a bit crap, but anyway. Woohoo! The first weather station I got were about eight years ago, and I've always wanted one of these ones. I bought a, a Maplin's one. <clears throat> dun, 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 box in a box. There she is, boys and girls. Anybody that knows what weather stations are or know what this one is, it's only for home, really. It's, they do um, proper um, stuff for, for uh, farmers and things that monitor soil and all that crap. But I'm just interested in the weather. The dog's interested in the box. What is it, Stan? So it looks like somebody's gave it a bit of damage there. So let's just hope the bugger's all right inside. Catch you. Right, <clears throat> I've just undone them flaps and stuff. So we've got the... Uh, Manual, blah blah, use your gubbins, put that there. <coughs> Inside, it's got the uh, directional thing there. The old anerometer, wind gauge, cups, standard stuff. There's the uh, pretty boring stuff, boys, but anyway, there's the unit. Got the radiation shield. I think the, yeah, the. That's the uh, weather cup. Where are we? Got the weather cup there that pops in. It's all pretty modular stuff. And uh, I've been, <clears throat> been really looking forward to getting this bloody thing. Just hope it's everything's on Kidora because I know these can be a bit of a bugger with the battery backing up and stuff. Yeah. So there she is, boys. I'll set her up, hopefully. <clears throat> I've got to stick a post up somewhere and shift my old weather station down Golden anyway. So uh, I'll get back to you later on when I've actually sussed it all out. There's some extra bits here. There's a kickstand for it. Power supply out. That's a UK one. It should be. I think this is a UK version. I'll just have a look. Yeah, cool. UK plug. Ah, lovely. That's what we want to see. And we've also got the mountain bracket U-bolt thing. Um, I think this should be, yeah, there's a there's a little tiny dingle, dongle thing that you stick into the um, the water uh, rain gauge to stop crap getting in it. We've got a um, little CR123 battery, battery cover. Uh, that's about it for the box, boys. Anyway, <laughs> toys for boys. I'll catch you all in a bit. Oh, boys, I've just... Uh... I fit the uh, directional um, arrow on and also the uh, the wind cups. I tell you what, this seems like absolute Rolls Royce. After the crappy ones I've had in the past, this is like really smooth and just feels uh, well made, well made even. Um, initial impressions are pretty, pretty favourable. It's even got, so that you can get it levelled correctly, it's even got a bubble level in the top lot. So, uh, Fingers crossed, it's going to be good, and I'll probably be boring you on my next video about how wonderful it is. <laughs> also, I've just put the battery in now, and you can just see it flickering there. It's supposed to do that for a while, and then that'll go off to save the batteries, apparently. Um, I think I'm supposed to set the console up now, but uh, I'm going to try and stick this outside in a minute. I'll catch you in a bit. Well, I've just put up at the bottom of the garden on a crappy bit of angle line. It's not ideal, but I've got it bubble level set up. And even though it looks like it's on the piss, it's actually not. It's a bit of a bodge job, really, to be quite honest with you. But anyway, there she is. I'm going to try and see if I can set the console up next. Well, it's supposed to be three C cells, so let's see what happens. Yeah, they seem a bit loose. That's never right. Oh, there we go. 
it will catch in them something and one in there that's it's supposed to be not a clue what's going to happen now boys it's not really light here Right, I've got to go through the setup, so I'll get back when I've done all this crap. Well, boys, I've about set it all up. I don't know how well this has come out on camera, but it's absolutely mint. God, how much can I tell? This is a bit, million times better than my original old system I had. Anyway, I'm just going to have a bit of a tinker, boys. I'll catch you well, in Boys, a bit. it's in my little man cave, chaining away. I'm waiting for it to get some trends on it and that. So anyway, I'm really pleased with it at the minute. Fingers crossed it uh, keeps on running reliably. Anyway, nice little... Uh, what I do when I'm not messing about with flipping camping stuff, I'm messing about with some other crap. Catch you later. This made me laugh, boys. It's a common one on this um, Davis, but we've um, just got a rainstorm, and it's as you can see when it comes back up. If it does come back up, <laughs> it's gone now. Rain's packed up. Oh, it is. It's raining cats and dogs has come back. How cool is that?